guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here welcome to my channel today I wanted to do DIY bridesmaids gifts if you want to see how I made my DIY bridesmaids gifts and what I put in my gifts um, just keep on watching so the first item that I um, got the girls this little blue cosmetic bag it is so cute um, I got their initials on them and I think they really really liked them that was probably my favorite gift and I kind of regret not getting one for myself and I think it was like $10 just for the cosmetic bag and then if you wanted to put a personalization on them um, like in this instance their initials I think it was like $3.99 or $4.99 so each of them ended up costing about 14 to 15 dollars and I got them pretty fast I ordered them and I probably got them in about a week and a half to two weeks and again it's personalized so it took a little bit longer than if you just got them but those are my favorite little gifts that I got another thing that I got was a robe it's so like cliche so many people do robes and and I, I wanted a robe because, you know, like I didn't want the girls to have to wear a bra the day of the wedding and then like get lines and stuff. So I got everybody a robe. Um, but what I didn't want was like a robe that said bridesmaid because I want them to wear it whenever they want. My friend Shelby, she loves robes and she's like, I see her wearing it like her little Instagram stories and I'm like, oh. But if it had bridesmaid on it, like she really couldn't wear it as often as she does now. So that's kind of one of the biggest things that I wanted to get them, but I knew I didn't want it to say bridesmaid. So that was Kali. He's he's watching Power Rangers. The ones on Amazon, like for one robe, it was like anywhere from I don't know. 15 to 25 dollars but i was like really 25 bucks for a robe like and i don't know if they're gonna wear it often so i was like it's okay i'll you know i'll look somewhere else so it was either i order expensive ones on amazon or i go in the store and try and find them without bridesmaid but one day me and Kali were at walmart as I was walking, like I turned and I was like, oh, oh my God. And I saw robes and they were so pretty. And I was like, hmm. Saw like these white and uh, bluish ones. And I was like, oh my gosh. Like they're, they're the bag, the cosmetic bag that I just bought them is like a bluish color. These robes are like a bluish color. We're going to be by the beach. It's going to be like ocean vibes, you know? So I was like, I really like these so I needed to make sure I had five and thank the heavens they had five I got five of them there at Walmart y'all four dollars and 97 cents that's how much these robes cost and i was like okay is this wrong this 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 is a joke like i would have spent 20 plus dollars on one robe now i'm spending 25 on all five of these robes and i was like this is amazing i got those robes checked out bagged them got them so now i have my blue bag and my robe and I loved both of them. And then I was like, okay, now, like those are the two bigger, I guess I would say bigger items that I got. And, um, but I knew I wanted uh, all of us to match as far as earrings. And not so much me, but I wanted all the girls to match with earrings and their hair since all of their dresses were different. I was like, man, where can I find, you know, inexpensive but really cute jewelry? hello forever 21 and i'm such a stud like hello i ended up finding some really cute ones at forever 21 
and forever 21 like you know their studs are like i don't know five bucks or like 4.90 it's some random number so i want to say they're like five dollars each each pair of earrings so i ended up getting them studs also and i think their studs are super cute i'll put it in the next slide super cute studs um super simple they can wear them on my wedding day but also you know after the wedding has come and passed they can wear them again um and they you know they just they can keep them forever so i got the cosmetic bag the robe and studs for all of them to match and then another thing that i got them was i feel like i'm missing something oh <laughs> hello the hangers I looked all over like Etsy, I looked on Google, like I googled uh, bridesmaids hangers and they just were all, again, pretty expensive. So I was like, man, like I can make these, it's literally I can make these, it's not rocket science. I ended up getting the white hangers on Amazon and then I got the gold stickers from Target and I just came home and I literally just put their name on them. It was not hard at all. I will show you how I did them right now. final things that I got them so it was the hanger the earrings the cosmetic bag and the robe and then I was like okay like that's that's pretty good let me just get like let me just throw in two little of the EO how do you pronounce it is it EOS lip balm but just like these little guys those I ended up getting them each two of those and I use lip balm every single day so I was like, I think, I'm pretty sure that they'll use lip balm, I would assume. You know, to not keep their lips all crusty. In the blue cosmetic bag, I rolled up the robe, put it in there, and then um, once it was laid down, I put the earrings, and then I put the two little uh, lip balms, and that was inside of the cosmetic bag. And then the gift bags, I got a pack of six, and I really liked them because they went from like super light purple to like lighter, or super light to a little bit darker, super dark, super dark. And so I liked the shade of colors or the shade of purple. In that purple bag, I put the cosmetic bag and then I put the hanger inside and then i put some tissue paper on top i actually did that at six in the morning i was the first one to wake up on my wedding day because i was just so like excited and nervous and like oh my gosh the day's finally here so i actually woke up super early on the day of my wedding put those together like super quick i had already had the the cosmetic bag all together and wrapped like each of them the only thing i needed to do was put the cosmetic bag in the purple gift bag and put the hanger with the tissue paper that's all i needed to do i did that like in less than 10 minutes and then after that i went off to the beach i laid out left for an hour and a half on the beach just thinking of like our wedding day i know right so like out of a movie but anyway they were super cute i think they liked them i mean nobody's gonna tell you if they didn't like the gift and quite frankly, I would have liked that gift. I always try and get, oh gosh. <laughs> I always try and get gifts that I will like, like for myself. I loved their their little gifts. I think they were, to me, they were thoughtful. I wanted them to have a little bit of personalization, but still something that they can continue to use even after the wedding was here and gone. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I am apologizing now that I don't have actual footage of all of the get like the whole gift together. Um, 
I gave it to them back in June. We're already in January. Um, and it was just, I think I had a lot going on, so I didn't record you know, me buying the presents or anything like that. And I really wish I would have, but like I said, I will try and link everything, um, or at least as close as possible. Like the robes at Walmart, they may not be $5 anymore, but you may find some a lot cheaper at Walmart than you would like on Etsy or, you know, somewhere like that. But I'll let y'all know. What? Can I help you? Stop. <laughs> but yeah so i will let y'all go so i can feed this child move your hair i will let y'all go so i can feed the lord i still see them using like their earrings or their robes or or um stuff like that so and all of them still use their cosmetic bags i think um so yeah if y'all have questions or anything for the most part, I'll put everything down in this dis <laughs> okay. for, the most part, for the most part, I put everything down in the description box or I will put everything down in the description box so that way y'all can kind of reference there. Um, but yeah, if y'all have questions, feel free to comment or um, message me like on Insta. <laughs> um, but yeah. Bye y'all. Bye y'all. Peace and I will see y'all later. I'll see y'all later. <laughs>